Good morning to all of us tuning in. This is the Rebel Lemon, and today we're playing Neon Mint. So, we're a knight fighting the occult, beating them before they take us down. This is a very interesting, I guess, rogue like game. I'm not really sure what to call it. Um, essentially, it's a card battler, but we actually have to create the cards ourselves. So they'll give us some fragments, and we have to stick the fragments together to create the card and the effect, which we can synergize really well or really badly. And you know what? That intrigued me. So, with that being said, let's get right into it. Okay, so, let's see. I don't know what any of these are, but, um... So, that's... To attack? Oh, okay, so... Okay, so they're gonna have one attack. So that's defense. Defense only lasts one turn. So I guess there's nothing wrong with doing a two attack. Okay, so that's draw two card. Gain two armor. Deal two damage each time. Oh. Oh yeah, let's do that then. Oh, that's big damage. Um, and then end turn. One action, one damage. Let's take them out, actually. Oh, that wasn't it. Okay, let's do it. Oh, shit, that one. Oh, but we can throw... One of these in, I guess? Yeah, that's much better. Spend one action, gain two armor. We don't really need to do that. We'll do this. Um, spend two actions, gain one armor each time, one damage, or one card. I'm gonna take this one. Oh, okay. I'm understanding how this works. So the action is on top, the multiplier is the bottom left, and then what you're doing is the bottom right. That makes sense. So what we can do, two actions, add two damage, that gives us four. Then what we can do is one action and one armor then two action and two damage okay I'm much better at this two actions two damage one action but three armor I'm gonna take this because it gives us a three Okay, so... Oh, see, this time they have three armor. Or that's what they're gonna apply. So... I guess we can throw this up? Um... 
Okay, they're gonna be doing three attacks. So, what we can do is this. And that gives us the three armor we need. Oh, and it's only one action. So what happens if we go and... Okay, so that gives us the three armor. And we can end our turn. That one looks special, but it doesn't seem like it. Oh, and we don't have any attack. Shit, okay, we can just end our turn then. That's not a big issue, actually. So, two, two. That's only gonna do one damage, though. I genuinely think we'd be better off just negating the attack. And ending our turn. And then this turn, we go for the big damage. And that's victory. Select the card from your deck to modify. Um, I guess this one. Oh, we can select the fragment to switch. Yes, give me that three. Oh my god, we're making some cards better. Okay, so in the future, we have to make sure to pick the worst cards we have to see if we can get better modifiers. So, two actions at three damage each. And we can do one action and get us three cards. That will be a big utility for next time. Okay, so they're gonna do four damage. So if we hit like this, that will give us more armor. So that will negate. And then... We don't have enough action to defeat them this go around. Yeah, because we can't use this. So what we can do is this. And do one damage. And then... Oh, I don't think we actually did damage that round. Because they had, um... A shielding. But, that does allow us to... Uh, take them out this time. Um... I'll take this one. I, I want those big numbers. Because in the future, I will try to modify the top one more. But I'm going to need to make sure to keep a few ones anyway. Okay, so they're going to attack. So what we could do is one, two, shield. And then two, three, attack. Okay, we're on floor five. This is not bad so far. Um, that will give us the two armor we need. Hmm, but I'm kind of thinking. Okay, well, I'm gonna go for it, even if this is seemingly a bad idea. Yeah, and this is where we get knocked out. I can already... Yeah, 
Yeah, we got really lucky, but we still lost two health. That is really not good. Uh, yeah, that's three, two. We're kind of lacking on the defense. So what we can do is two and shield. And build up a card. I'm gonna go for this, just for that big damage, but... Yeah. What kind of thought? Because damage-wise, we could get three off. Or we can get... Yeah. Okay, so we just need to... Defend. Oh god, we're so fucked this go around. We made it? Okay, to modify. Okay, so... The worst one here... Might be the draw. But if I can get a better... I, I don't want to touch the, um, the draw though. Okay, I'll pick this one. The fuck is this? Oh, that is game. Oh, shit. So I can turn this into three. Like this big three here, which I would do. But that gains us action. I'm gonna take this. This could be big. Okay, so... We're gonna go... Oh, we... If we need to defend fully, we're gonna be taking damage. Oh, that is... So we can either defend fully, or we can take some damage. That's such a shitty thing to decide. Um... I guess what I'm gonna do is fully defend. And then... Attack with what I can. But on the weaker side. I wanna try and keep this too. The fuck do we do? Oh, so that mod- I need a bigger modifier than- I need a bigger modifier than one. Oh, that is so shitty. We're gonna die either way. So I'll go biggest damage I can. That was kind of fun, actually. We made it to round 7. Granted, I do think I could have done a bit better, in hindsight. But as far as how I did, not bad at all. I guess one thing I was a bit disappointed in was that the fact all of the enemies look the same, but on the flip side, this is a game that I would definitely play on my own, uh, play around with stuff, test stuff out, but I will also say I do kinda 
wish this had more mechanics to incentivize you to try a game for like an upgrade mechanic or something where you could upgrade your health a bit to a certain point, upgrade your uh, starting actions um, I don't know, stuff like that um, it would actually be kind of nice. But yeah, or even like being able to unlock some starter cards. So even if your deck starts with six, you could modify that a bit, which would kind of be nice. Yeah, I don't know. I see a lot of potential for this game. But as it stands now it is really fun so i'll give it that so with that being said though i don't have really much to say it is a short game it's a fun game and i like the graphics simple but also very very nice <laughs> so with that being said thank you for tuning into the frequency this is the Rebel Lemon signing off. So good night and sweet nightmares.